колеги, доброго ранку. Good morning, dear colleagues. We start our working day in the Ukrainian Crisis Media Center, and I invite to the microphone an MP, Ms. Leshenko, who will discuss submission uh, by the Prosecutor's General Office uh, to the arrest and uh, uh, seizure of uh, Mr. Boyko's property. <coughs> Good morning, dear Ukrainians. My briefing is devoted to the fact that after the first uh, year of uh, uh, Prosecutor General Mr. Boyko, he managed to, uh, uh, with the, to protect uh, the godfather of uh, Rosukur and Erka uh, company, uh, shell company, uh, and uh, uh, corruptioneer in the gas market, Mr. Yuri Boyko, from responsibility. During the first year in uh, position, uh, Prosecutor Lutsenka uh, did nothing to bring Mr. Boyko to responsibility for his corrupt deeds and even uh, managed to hide all the documents uh, um, uh, which might bring Mr. Boyko to responsibility. Here in my hand, you see the submission and the arguments about uh, uh, criminal uh, deeds committed by Boyko. Uh, this submission was prepared by senior prosecutor submitted to Shokin. Then Shokin was dismissed, and this same document was submitted to new prosecutor general, Mr. Lutsenka. But Mr. Lutsenka again blocked this despite his promises to this to make disclosure about the corrupt actions of Yanukovych band and uh, uh, thus uh, we um, see an attempt not to bring to responsibility uh, one of the um, comrades of Yanukovych. I had uh, received this uh, document uh, and uh, 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 Lutsenko commented that uh, the investigation continues. When I submitted this document to him, I received the answer from, from Lutsenko that investigation continues and that um, he has no information about this document. Uh, again, this document was submitted to the Prosecutor General. Um, and uh, now uh, I think that uh, this document is sufficient and complete to send it to the Verhovda Rada. But I th think that there is collusion. Uh, uh, at the level of the Prosecutor General of uh, uh, Ukraine, Military Prosecutor General. Uh, as far as I know, Mr. Mate was requalified the role of Boyka uh, as a witness, not one of the accused. Uh, there were several investigations about Boyko, about uh, uh, liquefied gas, about drilling rigs, and uh, by the way, the case about drilling uh, rigs, uh, uh, um, there were uh, two brothers who were almost teenagers, and uh, they um, uh, 
made the corrupt uh, uh, transaction with the um, uh, extremely expensive with procurement of extremely expensive drilling rigs for Chernomor nafta gas and offshore drilling. Uh, In this uh, submission, which uh, was compiled uh, by investigators uh, of the Prosecutor General Office in result of prosecution, it is stated that Yuri Boyka, uh, uh, under Yanukovych regime, promoted and uh, supported Kurchenko in his criminal schemes. Uh, Kurchenko had created a um, chain of uh, um, enterprises buying liquefied natural gas from Ukr Gazvedobovania and Ukr Nafta. That gas had to be sold at the auctions for the needs of population, but instead of this, that liquefied natural gas was uh, buyed was bought um, at the lowest prices and then sold uh, at higher prices and uh, this was uh, and uh, that uh, um, damage to the state budget the damages to the state budget amounted to 700 million hryvnia Uh, then later they had to compensate uh, um, uh, 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 for this liquefied gas which was not uh, uh, supplied to population. Uh, then uh, Mr. Uh, Boyka uh, uh, many times applied uh, to uh, the prosecutor general about this criminal scheme, but as soon as he became the uh, energy minister of energy in Azarov's government, uh, he immediately stopped doing this. Uh, this submission, which I would like to uh, publicize today, this is uh, uh, prosecutor's uh, uh, suggestion to uh, do, uh, to accuse Mr. Boyka in article in line with Article 191, Part 5 of the Criminal Code of Ukraine, uh, uh, which entails responsibility uh, of up to 20 years in jail. Um, I believe that non-action of the Prosecutor General Office in terms of Mr. Boyka and uh, other officials uh, uh, would not be possible without uh, support from the top officials and uh, top uh, um, uh, leadership of the state. I believe that uh, the prosecutor's office is supported uh, from Bankava Street in the attempts to hide this uh, document. This document you can see on screen. The document is fully available and a year after it was uh, provided to the new Prosecutor General, Mr. Lutsenka, Mr. Boyka remains uh, uh, in, um, in his position and uh, he is not brought to responsibility and uh, our experience proves that all the corruptioners who had been robbing the state for many years, they remain in place. We have time just for one very short question. Ukrainian National News, could you please specify 
what fact uh, uh, is emphasized in this submission? Larissa Sagan has uh, published uh, uh, um, information uh, to Lutsenko that accusation to Boyko was uh, prepared um, in line with Part 5, Article 191. I think this is a distortion. This document is not about the drilling rigs. This is the document about the liquefied natural gas scheme. Uh, this is a different case. Uh, the case number... Uh, uh, 1201 300 to 2, um, and it was started uh, in June um, 2015. The document is available on website, and uh, you uh, will see from the document that Boyka was a key person in Kurchenko's uh, uh, scheme with liquefied natural gas. Uh, when the Prosecutor General points out that this uh, submission has nothing to do with uh, uh, Boyka uh, drilling rigs, um, well, that's right, but this is uh, a distortion of facts uh, because this very submission uh, to the prosecutor is in different case. This only shows uh, that uh, uh, these corruptioners earned money in result of corruption and shared this money with their uh, uh, comrades who now remain in power. This is the document which proves that uh, um, uh, Boyka was uh, a part of the Kuchenka scheme with uh, L, uh, LNG. And if Mr. Lutsenka uh, distrust and is not confident in this very person, uh, then he should dismiss him because this very investigator, this very prosecutor is involved in too many other affairs. Uh, I think this document discloses a huge affair which allows Mr. Boyka to remain non-punished with the support of General Prosecutor and the President of Ukraine. Thank you.